Hey everybody, how's it going? I'd like to welcome you to another broadcast of Texas Flycaster. Today we're taking a look at a video that I shot on July 7th. That was last weekend. That would be 4th of July weekend, 7-7 of 2013. This originally started out as a music video, but uh, my editor nixed that idea, saying it didn't make much sense. And I, of course, agreed with her. So we're going to talk about this video. This is the northern parts of Lake Ray Roberts. We're on open points. And uh, right now, the carp are pretty active up north. We've kind of fallen off on the south end and in the coves. The activity has kind of dwindled. And I think it's based on basically ambient water temperatures being pretty high, um, the food sources being pretty low due to the drought that's just pounding this lake. And we uh, had some luck up north. The wind's blowing up that way. It's kind of exposed, but we still were able to get out and do some wading on some shallow points. This is a super secret spot, like I said, so you'll have to uh, get a hold of me and perhaps even book a trip if you want to go hit one of these spots that are kind of hard to access and kind of hard to find again if you're on your own. Um, as we get to the last part of the video, what's happening is I handed the camera over to CK and he shot some video of me trying to wrestle a bass, which turned into basically a bass noodling event. Catfish are too easy, so we decided to see if I could noodle for a bass. Watch for this. It's crazy. Okay, here's this part I'm telling you about. A bass I'd caught on the edge of this old tank, and he had uh, kind of wound himself up in something. I was only using a six weight, and this is probably about a two to three pounder, and he jumped and ran, and when he ran, he ran in and got himself hung up on something quite intelligently. So I decided to take the plunge here in a second and see if I could get him loose because I could still feel him on the line, but I also knew that he was wrapped around something. So I waited off in here while CK held the camera, and I went new link for bass. So it's a new experience, but I was pretty determined. When I got down there, as soon as he felt me on him, uh, he broke the line and it was all over. You wouldn't know that unless I put this audio on here. So here's the agony of defeat right here in living color. Thanks for watching. As always, if you have any ideas, comments, compliments, or anything else, feel free to let me know. Hope you had a great 4th of July, and you'll be seeing the new video about Port O'Connor real soon.